Hey community, we're at Free Fly Fest 2023. I want to thank Free Fly Systems for inviting us to meet their community, meet their research network, meet their partners, because today they, they have a new announcement. They just announced the Pilot Pro controller and it's running all the open technologies that you can think of. What's most exciting about it is because you can switch radio telemetries. They have support for the Hearlink, Doodle Labs, and there's more to be coming soon. Yeah, we're up here in Stanwood, Washington, about an hour north of our Woodenville offices, and we're hosting our first annual Free Fly Fest. So it's really a day to celebrate our partners and all the folks that helped us get to where we are today. We've got about 12 different partners out here with all sorts of different payloads and software workflows, and we really want to bring this whole community together to help solve the problems that our customers are, are asking for help with. You'll see here today all these payloads who have adopted the Pixhawk payload bus standard, and now because they've integrated that into their payload, it just becomes plug and play on a quick release onto our Astro aircraft or anybody else's Pixhawk-based uh, flight controller aircraft. We are representing Altarion here at Freefly Fest. So uh, to basically educate people around what is the Euterion ecosystem, uh, what type of software uh, powered by Euterion uh, Astro flies. Euterion S is powering both the autopilot and the companion computer that is uh, on a Skynode hardware and Freefly has taken the Skynode reference design and implemented it into their own version and this version is running now on the Freefly systems Astro. Hey, I'm Corey from Freefly, uh, so I work on the embedded system side of things. And uh, today we announced the Pilot Pro controller, which is a really cool uh, kind of universal modular controller for a bunch of our products, uh, mainly to control the Astro and Alta drones. Um, yeah, so we're really excited to release that and show it to the world. Yeah, I worked on the Pixhawk payload bus, um, and that was, that was a pretty cool standard that we put together in order to improve interoperability. 